4 o'clock. Time for one more rehearsal in Bandim Quarter, in the capital of Guinea-Bissau. Hector Diogenes Casama directs the Netos de Bandim, Portuguese for Bandim's grandchildren. The group, which has more than 100 members of all ages, promotes the culture of Guinea-Bissau. They've already rescued 23 traditional dances from oblivion. Part of our work is going to a specific region where an ethnic group lives and we collect information about the dance, music and costumes. Later in Bissau, the group works on the dance and on the cultural components we rescued. Since its foundation in the year 2000, Netos de Bandim has won almost all the local and national carnival parades, gaining popularity among the youth. Through traditional dances and music, Netos de Bandim has helped keep children off the streets and given them an opportunity. Megalino Suarez de Gama grew up without parents. Today, he is a popular percussionist. I used to lead the life of a street child. I hung around in the streets doing bad things, like stealing. But Netos de Bandim changed my life completely. Now I am studying law at the university. Hector Casama's initiative helps teenagers to discover their own talents and overcome obstacles in their lives. Most of the children in Netos de Bandim are vendors, orphans. They spend almost 70% of their time doing some work. And we support children in terms of education and health care. The organization relies solely on shows to generate income. There's no external support. Half of the profits go towards supporting the young dancers, such as Myra Paulina Ju, who recently graduated. I used to spend time as a vendor at the market. But Neto Sebandim's help enabled me to go to school every day. Now I don't go to the Bandi market anymore. I'm too busy at school. Neto Stebandim also offers literacy training for parents and vocational courses for the young. Currently, the group has partnerships with several schools and training centers. We have 10 to 15 young people attending training courses. Neto Stebandim have already taken Guinea-Bissau's culture to Gambia, Senegal and Portugal and to Carnival in Brazil.